prior to 2008, we had a, a flood ordinance, um, but the, uh, the the floods of uh, 2008 forced us to take a hard look at what we had on the books and what we had done already and what we needed to do to react to it because we did experience a fair amount of loss and, and, and destruction of property as a result of that. And we had uh, an in interruption of, of, of traffic, we had uh, inundated structures, we had displaced uh, populations and businesses, uh, and an impact to the, to the business community and the university and traffic flow and a lot of things. And so we had to take a look at all of those uh, aspects uh, and we decided to take a comprehensive look at what was on the books and what we could do to prevent uh, future uh, such issues. Uh, and so we responded with uh, ordinances and, and, a, and a series of, of uh, capital improvement projects, uh, flood protection, mitigation, and things like that. It was a comprehensive response to a flood. Great. Dave, let me elaborate just a little bit. You probably know that we had a major flood in 1993. Right. And people around here thought that was the biggest thing that had happened here in uh, decades or whatever. It was a really intense event. So everybody thought we were in good shape. We thought we had good ordinances in place and all that kind of stuff. And then 2008 happened. It was much more severe than 1993. So we had to revisit that, and yeah. the council did that. Yeah.